facing Tyrell, who's got two strikeouts already. He's showing that he's throwing strikes all day. And there's another strikeout. I'm at least a third. And there we see that ball's going to get down. Oh. And we're going to see Cole racing to third. That ball's headed home. And two Notre Dame runners have scored. Both Lamana and Coatsy score. Here's the one, two. That ball right up the middle. And that ball gets into the hole. That will score two runners there. And Spencer Myers does what is needed to be done. Here. Yeah, and as you talk to start this inning, as that ball is put into the gap, great play there. No Wow, way. that was a wonderful play by Carter Putz. That 2-0 pitch rocketed, and that one is gone. That ball is ripped by Coatsy. Brooks Coatsy takes the 2-0 pitch from Glassy and sends that one straight out. Runner goes, and that ball is ripped deep. But another one that is going to be popped up to the center fielder. Oh, my uh, goodness. If they want to continue to be competitive in this game. That ball is ripped to left field, and that ball is gone. Same spot as Glassy let up before. That is a... Bomb by TJ Williams. They're taking advantage of that short fence in left as they've ripped two home runs today right outside of that fence for Notre Dame. Continue with a pitch like that in the dirt. That one's right <laughs> down the middle, a little low, but a very, very nice play. Janice has the ability to do that as he rips a ball down the first baseline, and that will be the game there. We see Brannigan excited to get out of that bases loaded jam with Notre Dame coming out of today with the W going to 6-1 on the season.